in general, using hand dryers is a better step up from using paper towels. Just in general, even when you're using run-of-the-mill hand dryers. Um, using high efficiency, high speed hand dryers is a step better. Um, the reason for that, and people kind of come to me and they say, well, if you're using hand dryers, doesn't that mean you're using energy? Isn't that a bad thing? Whereas, you know, paper towel dispenser doesn't use any energy for the most part. Um, the real difference, and it's kind of, it seems like you're comparing apples to oranges, but you're really not, is the comparison between the energy use of a hand dryer and the energy used in the paper, in the production and the distribution of the paper in a paper towel dispenser. Um, so while paper doesn't seem like a high impact product, it really is. It takes a lot of carbon, essentially, to cut down trees in Brazil or Indonesia, to you know ship them to the coast uh, in trucks, and then to put them on a boat and take them all the way to New York, have them refined into paper, which then uses electricity. There's a lot of energy used in those steps. Um, and it's actually a lot more than it's used in a hand dryer. Um, Furthermore, the energy that's used in it is not as easily transferable to renewable sources. So the energy that we use for a hand dryer, for example, is coming from, you know, mostly in the United States, energy electricity comes from coal-fired power plants. But more and more, and we expect this to, to grow over time, um, those energy sources are going to be renewable sources, wind, solar, things like that. Um, and so more and more of that energy for, for hand dryers can come from renewable sources. Whereas for paper towels, it's much harder to replace all of the gasoline, essentially, that they're using to get that paper to America to produce it, to turn it from a tree into a paper towel.